Good morning, guys. You know, for years, Ellie has talked about utilizing your backyard. And for years, I've wondered, what does that mean, Ellie? <laughs> well, because we're really slow at utilizing our backyard. But just the city, the state that you live in. More often than not, the places that you are closest to, you don't visit that often. And that's so true for us. But now that is changing. We live 45 minutes away from Zion National Park and we haven't really been there yet. But today we are changing that. We are staying at the White Bison Resort 15 minutes away from Zion and we are gonna spend our entire weekend here. Come with us while we give you a tour of where we are going to stay and the adventures that we're going to do. Welcome to our little cliffside dwelling. As you walk in, you see it's not very big, but there's a lot of stuff in here. In fact, you have a pretty decently sized kitchen with fridge, sink, utensils, and then you turn and there's the bathroom, which is surprisingly big. And even bigger is the shower. We could not believe how much space we had in the entire bathroom. Then at the front, you have a TV with a chest of drawers. On the flip side, you have a king size bed, which can be two queens, or a king, and then a sofa with pull-out sleeper. Let's go upstairs and see what we have on top. Walking up, you automatically see a hot tub. You know we're gonna be using that. A table with chairs and a grill. But that's not the best part. The best part is this view. Can't believe it. thing that we wanted to do today was go on a bike ride. So we're in Zions National Park and oh my gosh, look how beautiful this is. I can't even believe it. Are you just so happy right now? Oh, I'm so delighted. <laughs> he looks like a frog. His band-aid, his legs, his hair. Oh my gosh. How can you go from <sighs> one minute just being like, I am so done, to the next minute you're like, Chris, so much gratitude. Oh, just like, I wish I could do that all over I'm again. I'm like out of breath. So on our way back, I had Jared hold Tommy's bike and Tommy sat on my lap because he was not listening and there was too many bikers. So he sat on my lap and on our way back, he goes, I'm mad at dad. And he said, why? <laughs> he has my bike. Oh, <laughs> he is so silly. And I, I was like, well, you didn't listen. <laughs> yeah, it's true. His bike, if you guys didn't know, like that's his identity. That's what he does every single day, the All moment day. he wakes up to the moment he goes to bed, is ride his bike. Yep. He's like, he eats his cereal and then he's like, okay, bike time. Mm. We go on the same walk every day. He rides his bike all day long. So our first time to Zion with the kids on bikes, it was a little stressful. Very, but it was so fun. Oh yeah, it was so much fun. And that was just, part of the first day. We've got so much stuff that we're gonna do today and tomorrow. So we gotta get back to our little cliff dwelling so we can get ready for dinner.
the wrong oh, one, Tommy. Dad, I want to make some beer. Okay, go sit next to Rihanna. You look like you've been playing hard. She's like having grandma here. I know, right? She just said... <laughs> I feel weird sitting, but she's like, going to have the kids make some yeah. root beer, and I am loving this. Okay, so this is what we're going to do. You guys like root beer? Yeah. Okay, yeah. do you see this? Yeah. We're going to put it right here so you can all reach it. How about we make it right here? Yes. Yeah, that's sugar, yeah. So I feel completely spoiled. We have Rihanna's private dining here. She works all over the Zion area and you can hire her to come out and make a meal for you. And that's what we're having for dinner tonight. It feels weird. It feels weird watching, but I'm also like, I'm gonna enjoy this. Like yeah. I, as a mom, don't get that very much. And I did ask her, I was like, oh, so do you do like, like, like baptisms, like blessing events, like when we bless the baby, I was like, oh, that might be nice to like have her come so That'd that so I can fun. like enjoy. The company. Yes. Yeah. I love meeting new people. So tonight dinner is being made for us and I'm like so excited. And not only that, she's making root beer with the kids. Okay, show me the muscles. All right, all right, let's put it down right here. Do you kind of feel it? It's pot, cold. You feel it? Yeah. yeah. Now this is the best time to drink it. It's not really brown. That's gonna be nice cold root beer now. Here you are. Oh, thank you. Tell me what you think. Oh, it smells good. <laughs> So I'm for, taking her home. <laughs> I love you. We love Rihanna. We've only met her for like 10 Whatever minutes. Whatever she made in this dressing, it's a ginger lemon. No, it's a honey onion. Honey oh. onion. Yes. First menu item is salad, Wait, a berry salad, and fry bread. Next, we have potatoes and vegetables. And for the main course, we have pork chops and apples. Well, Ellie, how do you feel? I can't talk. I'm in a coma, a food coma. <laughs> so One of the best meals good. we've ever had. Thank it's you so, so much, fun. Rihanna. So delicious. We, I've been watching all the kids play on the rocks, literally eating dinner that I didn't have to cook. <laughs> yeah. It was so fun. It was so fun to get to know you and your yeah. business. Oh, you're so sweet. And mm. that's exactly like what happens, you know, Zion, you're hiking all day. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then people yeah, come biking. in to their Airbnbs or their vacation homes or you know something like this where they're glamping and they're like oh my gosh I don't have to make dinner and then those smells hit them it's a touch point yeah they don't realize <laughs> how good that's gonna feel oh. when it's just not even until there. they actually eat it and it's like oh my god but we've been able to watch the sunset look how majestic that is with all of the wagons Thinking back to the very beginning of this video, we talked about utilizing your own backyard. I think one of my regrets is that we didn't do it as much as we wanted to back in Logan where we used to live. We certainly did a lot, but I feel like there was so much more that we missed out on and we don't want to miss out on those opportunities now. There's so much that this world has to offer us and you don't have to go very far to experience that. And I think as a parent, one of the greatest things that I can do is create memories with my kids, be present with my kids. And I'm glad that we're able to do that in such a very cool place that isn't far from us. We are trying to utilize our backyard. We're just lucky enough that our backyard <laughs> happens to be Zions National Park. And tomorrow we have planned one of the most beautiful and easiest hikes that you can do with your family. And I'm so excited to take the kids on that adventure tomorrow. I want them to remember this for the rest of their lives as one of the most beautiful places that they can visit and maybe even someday take their family to it when they're all grown up. But for now, we're gonna enjoy each other's company while we watch the moon and the stars from the hot tub. Thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you from Zions National Park next time. Bye-bye.